Welcome, good people of the Internet. Now, I know that the last few years we heard a bit about Article 11 and Article 13 in Europe, how the Internet might lose its neutrality or blah, 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 blah. And then we forgot about it. It's weird that we forgot about it because the European Union kind of did say they would go through with it. And they did. But most people haven't even noticed. Now, obviously, most people don't notice because when they do go somewhere they're not supposed to go, this is usually what they see. The request could not be satisfied. The request was blocked. Okay, why? Well, don't really say that. And it gives you a little bit of... Um, non-distinct information fair enough now i'm using this website of uh, wtr and i know i know this article it's not that weird but the article isn't the reason why i'm showing you this the reason why i'm showing you this is because i try to and i'm not getting paid by this mind you i'm trying to tell you the importance of a vpn now if i change my location to the UK, you will notice that I'm still within Europe and nothing changes. But if I am, let's 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 be brave, let's go to Hong Kong. Look at me traveling to Hong Kong. Speed of light, baby, speed of light. Anyway, we're in Hong Kong now, and all of a sudden I'm allowed to read. This very important news story of uh, WTHR NBC. Now, of course, the commercials will be in Hong Kong, in, in, in Chinese, I assume. Not in Hong Kongese, sorry, my bad. But yeah, no, the, the, the story itself isn't that important. But somehow we're not allowed to see this in Europe. Is it Europe that's the problem? Well... It would seem that way because um, Hong Kong not an issue and um, let's let's travel real fast to Israel why not I mean might be useful who knows oh sorry it's not done yet was a little bit too fast it takes time to travel to Israel you might notice but yeah no I mean I'm in Israel now and the website is working perfectly fine. You know what? Let's um, let's 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 um, look around the world a little bit. Let's go to Italy. What do you think will happen when we're in Italy? I've not been to Italy in a long time. Oh, oh yeah, right. Because Italy is in Europe. Well, surely it's not just Europe. Well, surely there must be countries outside of Europe. Well, yeah, you know, that may be possible. I wouldn't know. Um, because most of the countries I can choose from are Western countries. So, yeah, the United States, Canada. I mean, I can't, I can't choose Argentina, I think. But I can go to... Uh, where did I go to? Let me see, let me see what I went to. I, I clicked something. Oh, I went to Canada. Oh, ho. ho. Yeah, no, Canada seems to work fine. Well, can I, can I go to Argentina? Come on, Brazil, Brazil, no, no Brazil. Uh, let's go all the way down. The United States, Canada, United Arab Emirates. Oh, South Africa. South Africa probably has a lot of restrictions too, should you think? I don't think so, but let's check. Is it okay to read in South Africa about how a county is tightening the rules on non-essential shopping because of the coronavirus. I have the feeling that maybe in South Africa they don't care either. So, if I am in, let's say, uh, let's, let's, let's pick another European country. I don't know. Serbia, Serbia. No, Hungary. Let's go Hungary. Hungary has been rather negative about the European Union. Can I find Hungary? Yeah, here is Hungary. But obviously they're part of the European Union. So let's see whether they comply. Well, what do you know?
they do. If anything I hope to have shown you here, good people, is that yes, the European Union has started censoring the web, and yes, there is a very important reason to have a good functioning VPN. Now, I have this one, show you again. It doesn't show the name. Oh, that's nice. Um, I can't remember the name. <laughs> uh, I said, Pia, I think it was. Personal something or other. But obviously there are lots of... Um, good VPNs out there so and yes I am in Europe as you can see so uh, there is that uh, which country am I going to go today yeah that's staying in Southampton while I'm playing a game that's all right then anyway like share and subscribe if you feel so inclined and I am more than curious what you think of this um, interesting interesting display of uh, censorship because let's be honest if nothing else that's what it is i mean it's an article about how certain places in the united states are limiting traffic to shops because of the coronavirus not something i would think is a huge issue in europe well it's an issue obviously it's an issue everywhere in the western world but everywhere in the western world we can read about it but not in Europe. <laughs> if, if nothing else, people, if nothing else, this proves you need a VPN if you're in Europe. Europe has just basically leveled itself on internet freedom with China. And I'm not sure if that's something you should be proud of. Anyway, criticism as always is more than welcome and I hope to see you all next time.